Chuck, uh, why are you running for uh, House 47? I want to run for the House of Representatives to make a difference. I always have been a uh, believer in being part of the solution. And instead of being on sidelines complaining about things, I want to get down there and, and make a difference and try and help uh, the Republican majority get things done. What should the state's overriding policy be on K-12 education? Well, we should invest uh, wisely in education. I'm a firm believer in that. I have um, six grandchildren that are going to be, uh, or are in public schools right now, or uh, the youngest granddaughter is gonna be attending school this fall, so I wanna make sure that they have the opportunity to have the highest quality education possible. During this session, tax policy was kind of at the forefront of things, particularly with Senate Bill 509. What do you think the state's overriding policy should be on tax rates and tax credits? Tax rates, I, I believe we're overtaxed. I, uh, I, I would like to make it a point to try and um, either keep our taxes the way they are now or uh, ideally have them lowered more. So. I, uh, I believe that we are extremely overtaxed in a lot of regards, whether it's sales tax, income taxes, or uh, property taxes, you name it. Uh, we just, uh, uh, every time you turn around, we're looking at a new tax somewhere. So that's one of my, uh, my goals is to go down there and try and uh, moderate that to make that, uh, uh, make it uh, a little less of an impact on everybody. So. Now, if you're elected, what would be your top three priorities? My top three priorities are, of course, the education. We already touched on that. Jobs in the economy and agriculture. There are two candidates running for the Republican nomination in this race, you and Betsy Phillips. Why should voters choose you? Well, Betsy's a friend of mine. We, uh, we've known each other for several years. I don't have anything bad to say about her, but I believe that... Uh, I, I would be the better candidate. I have a, a wealth of experience. I'm a sixth generation mid-Missourian. I'm a uh, farmer, I have a small business. We're here right now. And uh, I, uh, I have a wealth of experience. I worked for the government for 31 years. I was in the US military, uh, I was a Marine. And um, I believe I'm uh, very qualified to do this job. So I intend to, uh, to uh, get elected and I'm going to do the best uh, that I can. I'm going to represent the people uh, wisely. I'm going to show up, do my job. That's what I've done my entire career. I'm, uh, I'm a go-getter and I'm ready to tackle this, uh, this job and, and do it uh, very wisely and responsibly.